Hi beautifuls, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna do this 4th of July look that I just, you know, whipped together. In this video, I'll be using the Jaclyn Hill palette. So exciting, this palette is amazing. I came up with this 4th of July look using the palette. If you wanna see how to get this look, then just keep on watching. Ooh, yes, I was mad at you, but... So I already started recording, but I didn't realize that my lovely camera was blurry. So I'm just gonna start like again. As you can see, like some of it's already done, but I'll just explain it. Today I'm using the Jaclyn Hill palette. It looks like this. The inside is so nice, so pretty, and the shadows blend out super smooth and buttery. So as you can tell, I already done my base and um, some of my eyes. So I put this shade right here already in my crease. It's called Butter. I just builded it up. Builded. Built it up. I also put this color right here as my brow bone highlight. So after I buffed out butter in my crease, I'm gonna take Puder and Pukey, mix them both, and put that a little bit in my, right in the crease crease. Once that's done, I'm gonna start building up the red. I'm gonna take a flat brush, and I'm gonna take this color right here. It's called Hunts, and I'm gonna put that like on my inner corner and my outer corner and just blend it in. So with this flat brush, I'm just packing it on like that and like that, like really packing it on. And it doesn't matter if like I get fallout, I'll wipe it away with my translucent powder. So it's all good, it's all good. So as you can see, I've packed it on and it looks a mess. But then I'm gonna take like a tapered fluffy brush and just blend it all out. I'm gonna take some translucent powder on a blender and just, just do that right there to my eye so I can get that line. So you just blend, 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 blend. And then as I'm blending, I'm like taking it higher up into like my crease area, like right here, and right above my crease as well. And then again, taking more of that Hunt shade and just packing it on, and then going back in and blending it out. So then doing the same technique and using a different color, I'm gonna go into Jack's right here and just do the same thing. Pack it on, blend it out, pack it on, blend it out. And again, pack it on, blend it out. And it doesn't matter if it's messy because it's like a really blown out look anyway. Then I'm just taking any fluffy brush and then just um, blending it out and blowing it out. And then I'm gonna take that tapered blending brush and dip it into Jack's. Just run it right in my crease to deepen it. And then one more time with the fluffy brush, just blending everything together. So then I'm just gonna wipe this little bake away. Then I'm gonna... <coughs> then I'm gonna tight line with the Marc Jacobs highliner. Before I put the glitter or anything, I'm gonna line just like really close to my lash line with a uh, liquid liner. I line my lashes before glitter because it's just easier for me to do it that way because it's hard to put liner over glitter. You know what I mean? So I don't have glitter glue right now, so I'm gonna use the duo lash glue. And I'm gonna put it on the back of my hand. So I'm on the back of my hand, and then take one side of a brush. Just take the glue and just pop it on my eye. Then I'm gonna take my glitter and just push that onto it. Damn, that light looks really intense. So after I've done that, after I put the glitter, I'm gonna take Jack's and just diffuse it out and run it along to the top to hide the crease. And then once you've diffused all the glitter in, that's like the best I could do. I'm gonna take some glue again and put it in the right in the center and then just add some more glitter to that section. Once that's done, I'm gonna put on my lashes. I'm using the Demi Wispies by Ardell. 
then just once more, I'm gonna tight line. For my waterline, I'm gonna use a white eyeliner. And right under that, I'm gonna put this metallic blue. And then I'm gonna take the shade Twerk in the palette, this one right here, and just pack it on that lower lash line. And then I'm gonna take a little bit of Jax and also add it to the lower lash line, right under the blue one. And then I'm gonna go back in with the blue and smoke it out. Then I'm just gonna put mascara on my bottom lashes and retouch up the white in my waterline. And then I'm gonna take this color right here, it's called Beam, and I'm gonna put that in my inner corner. For my lips, I'm gonna put the Milani Metallics Lip Cream in the shade Matte. Mattily in Love. I added ColourPop London Fog on top just to give it more of a true red. So this is the finished look. I hope you guys liked watching it as much as I liked creating it. I hope everybody has an awesome 4th of July and stay safe. Please don't forget to subscribe before you leave and I'll see you in my next one. Bye!